What's up, YTPC? Big John coming back at you, baby, for another one of my five-minute, or at least attempt at a five-minute review. We're getting better. All we can do is get better, baby. Today, we're going to be looking at Rattray's Marlin Flag. I was able to pick up a couple of tens on the, le uh, on the last little uh, drop that they had going on. It's in the British collection. A little mixture of Black Cavendish, Perique, and the beautiful, beautiful Virginias. So, got a fresh little can here, sealed up. Yeah, yeah. So let's pop this bad boy because when I seen what this tobacco looks like, I don't know where I seen it at. It may have been Instagram somebody posted a picture of some of this stuff and it, I just had to have it just had to try it so let's see what it's popping let's get it oh dried fruit mm. sweet super super sweet I'll get you in a little closer here oh let's take a look at it I got to show you this all right YTPC welcome back welcome back let's take a look at this beautiful beautiful tobacco this is how it comes just Beautiful. Let's get a little pretty, pretty little presentation on that rolled up flake in there. Raisins and figs and just sweet, sweet. I don't even know what to describe it like baked goods type of sweet. Let's see what we got in that deal here. It's just pretty. It's just absolutely pretty. That is some beautiful, beautiful, beautiful tobacco. And it smells oh so, oh so delicious. <laughs> Man. All right. Let's get a little bit of this packed up. See what we can do with it. I'll be back in just a All right, YTPC. Well, we're back. Got it uh, broke down. As I was breaking it down, I got some real nice tangy notes. Um, sweet. Had to let it dry for a little bit. So this is kind of a, you know, welcome back. It's been <laughs> about 30 minutes or whatnot. But got it nice and packed up. Nice uh, kind of a, a looser pack. I'm still experimenting with the Virginias, still learning. But uh, packed it a little bit loose, got it dried up. Used a kind of like a rub down method on my hand, old Berg taught me. And uh, like to hear it, here it go. Let's see what we got. Whoa. Man. When you first light it, it's kind of like Orlick Golden Slices. But aged. Aged. Or like golden slices.
it's absolutely smooth. The Virginias are sweet. It's taken off pretty good. Maybe give it a little bit of a hit. It's naturally sweet, Virginia. It tastes wonderful. A little bit of wet out of the tin. A little bit of sticky. Like I said, it was like baked good notes, raisins, figs out of the tin. It's nice does require a little bit of a dry time it did just go out on me right now so you know that's uh, one of them things It's smooth. It's absolutely smooth. The perique is there and it's nice. It's not too spicy. It's more in the background. The Virginia is the star of the show. The black Cavendish is kind of weaved in between. Getting all the hay notes. Like white wine. Like a nice white wine. Mm. That nose sting that you normally get out of Virginia's when you when you get the retro ale and normally when you kind of bring it through breathe through your pipe and get that good flavor that does not sting this is a refined beautiful tobacco pipe doesn't feel like it's getting too hot I know I'm talking and I'm and I'm puffing right along but it's breaking down into a nice white ash the bowl looks real nice Looks like I'm going to be chasing some Marlin Flake. Well, YTPC, I don't want to hold you too long. You see that Marlin Flake? Grab it. It is a beautiful tobacco. Almost like... Pie crust and sweetness. I think we got a winner here. This is a beautiful tobacco. Well, YTPC, I don't think I did it any justice, but for my taste buds, that's what I'm getting. 
till I see you again. Peace.